battery compartment. The battery compartment is located on the street side of your Oliver. The marine style latch can be locked using the small key found on your key ring. After opening the battery compartment box, you will notice a slide out tray holding your batteries. Simply push the battery tray in to take pressure off the latch and lift the ball handle to unlatch the tray. If your trailer is equipped with the two latch battery tray, pull the two latches on the outside edge of the tray toward each other to release. Pull the tray out to inspect the batteries as needed. The standard battery package for both the Legacy Elite and Legacy Elite 2 is two 12-volt wet cell or flooded batteries. If you plan to primarily camp only at campsites that provide 120-volt power, the standard 12-volt battery should be sufficient. Flooded batteries will need periodic topping off with distilled water. Flooded batteries also release gas that requires venting, which you will find on the battery compartment door. Occasional cleaning of corrosion on battery terminals will ensure your batteries are performing and charging optimally. If you plan to camp off-grid, you may have chosen one of our 6-volt battery upgrades. The advantages of the 6-volt AGM batteries include having a lower discharge rate when not in use, deeper depth of discharge, charging up to five times faster than flooded batteries, spill-proof, vibration-resistant, maintenance-free, and perform better in cold temperatures. If you have the Legacy Elite with upgraded batteries, your delivery specialist will ensure that two 6-volt AGM batteries were installed. If you have upgraded the batteries on the Legacy Elite 2, you will have four 6-volt AGM batteries. You will notice that each connection has a quality mark that will make it easy for you to tell if your connections are loose. The batteries have been strapped down to prevent them from shifting during transit. Since the battery box compartment door is vented to prevent a buildup of gas, it is important to note that this is not a dry storage area. If you have purchased the optional solar package and or inverter, see our video for more information about charging your batteries when camping off-grid.